This is going to be a quick demo on how to uh, install virtual manage uh, virtual machine manager in Fedora. Um, I see lots of people running VirtualBox and uh, VMware uh, free versions and things like that. And the the truth is that KVM with Virtual Manager is um, very simple to set up, and uh, it it comes in your distro, and, and there's no closed source stuff, and uh, I I prefer it so. I thought I'd create a quick uh, demo on how to do it. First thing to do is to install the virtualization stuff in Vert Manager. So there's a virtualization package group that you can install using at virtualization with yum and then Vert Manager itself. So the virtualization package is going to install all the libvirt packages, all the QMU packages, all the KVM packages that you need to uh, get the virtualization environment up and running. And then Vert Manager is just a uh, simple, uh, say simple, a straightforward and user-friendly GTK uh, GUI application for managing your uh, virtual machines. So we're, I'm going to go through setting up uh, one, uh, one such machine. So after you do that, um, you can start Vert Manager just like that. So, well, all right. So that's the first thing you got to uh, turn on Virtual Manager. It doesn't uh, turn on when you install it, or I should say libvirt. All right, and now we're connected. So installing it is as simple as that. Um, I can demonstrate setting up a virtual machine uh, by downloading the um, Fedora server net install image. It's going to be this is going to be small, um, and it doesn't include any of the packages. It downloads them all from the mirror, but you'll get the idea. Um, so I'm just going to use a wget command and pull that down real quick. You can see here that the uh, Fedora server net install image. I'm going to move that to the uh, libvirt images directory, which is at var libvirt, uh, sorry, var lib libvirt images. Um, and that way it'll be easier to find when we create our uh, virtual machine. So here I'm just going <clears> to <throat> click on the cre create a new virtual machine. There's a button right here and say install lo uh, local me local install media and then browse and then here's our image right here and uh, this default storage pool is this var lib libvert images folder so we can just click here um, it automatically detects that that's linux and an installation disk for fedora 21 um, sure so you can set up your RAM and CPUs here. It says up to eight available. That number is determined by the number of physical cores you have on your machine. Um, these are, while the RAM, um, actually even the RAM, you can overcommit the RAM and you can overcommit the CPUs. Uh, these are non-exclusive uh, allocations here. Um, here you can create a uh, the QCAL2 image that it's going to use. I would just go with the defaults there might make it a little bit smaller than 20 gigabytes depending on the size of your root file system where this uh, images directory is and then um, you just hit finish and it boots into the fedora server installer you can go through all that and you have a virtual you'll have a virtual machine in just a few minutes